news now. We are just days away from the first visit to America by Pope Francis. He arrives on Tuesday. Millions are hoping to see him. A few will get to meet him. Charles Benson talked to one man who has already done both. Charles? Milwaukee Archbishop Jerome Listecki will be with Pope Francis in Washington and Philadelphia next week. Two million people are expected to see the Pope during an outdoor mass. Lots of people hoping to get to see him, potentially meet him. Uh, you have met him. You have been with him. I have been with him, right? Who is he? Um, he's a pastor. He's, you know, uh, he, uh, he's an individual who very much uh, cares about people and cares about basically his priestly role. He has a priestly heart, which means he, um, he looks to people and, and he wants to serve them. That's, that's why his vision is so inclusive. Archbishop Lestecki will join Pope Francis in D.C. for midday prayer with other U.S. bishops. But it's not just the planned events he's looking forward to. He also doesn't follow protocol. No, I mean, he he's a guy that likes to go maybe <laughs> a little bit off, uh, off the, the script. Event. Yeah, off the watch, script. Watch the people that surround him. Watch when he's kind of reading and then stops and raises his eyes and starts. You'll see. <laughs> Full of surprises, but still a powerful force for the church. Do you think the Pope is changing the church, or has the church changed, and he's just the right guy at the right I time? Don't, you know, I, you know, I, the change means you're being something different than what you, you were before. Bergoglio is the same that he was when he was uh, Archbishop, and you know, there's a lot more public exposure on uh, the manner in which he demonstrates, articulates his his office. Now, Archbishop Listecki will travel with about 25 Milwaukee area Catholics for the Festival of Families events and outdoor papal mass in Philadelphia on Sunday. By the way, you can see much more of my interview with Archbishop Listecki Sunday morning on Live at Daybreak. Charles, thank you.